I personally believe that almost anyone can become a leader and or a teacher in life. It's just so few individuals will actually go out and do it because they're so caught up in their perception of themselves, getting this imposter syndrome going on where they're saying, well, how can I lead other individuals? I'm not perfectly secure in myself and my ambitions are my goals and I don't have clarity. So how could I possibly guide another individual? But if we were to step back and not take ourselves so seriously and believe that our beliefs about ourselves are actually accurate, then we may find that we actually do have skill sets that we can teach others to have, or we have a drive or a passion for something that we don't quite give enough merit to because we don't believe it's valid. But when we just step back, like for me example, I went to school for communications and all my life, most of it, I keep going through thinking, oh, there's always somebody better than me. There's somebody who would be better than myself at this particular thing. So I'm not gonna teach people how to do my skill set. I'm not going to teach them how to communicate more effectively. I'm not going to try and lead anyone because I get anxious because there's somebody that's more skilled. But the more I talk to individuals and the more I share and the more I uh, give conversational attributes about the things that I know about, and the more I find that people don't, that most people don't know about the things I know about. And I realized that I can lead people in my areas of expertise, even if it's just talking about, you know, listening, just attentive listening. So few people actively think about this, but then you have other individuals who can tell you about IULs or who can tell you how to trade stocks or who can tell you how to make a free throw from the free throw line on basketball. We have so many individuals with skill sets that they can teach but because they're not the best or the top tier, they just automatically discredit themselves from what they can do. So if you have an area of expertise and you feel like you can't be a leader because you're not at the top, just you know, try. Because if you've spent any time actually trying to learn a skill or not do something, then you're probably in the over the top half of all humanity in that realm. So even just a little bit of skill set can give you the opportunity to become a mentor, a teacher, or a leader to the other individuals in life. And just because you don't think you're that great, doesn't even matter. You can learn how to play a few chords on the guitar and then teach somebody who knows no chords on the guitar and change their lives forever. So it's just not taking yourself too seriously, being willing to admit that, yeah, I may not be the best, but I can actually help other people at least get to my level. And I can lead these individuals down to a new path that they never thought was possible. So, yeah, that's the thought for today. You know, don't take yourself so seriously that you just sort of become paralyzed and become placated in this realm where you're not going out and sharing what you know just because you're afraid that you don't know enough. Because the real journey that we're on, the real wisdom, the real insight comes from the experience and the teachings and the downfalls and the getting back up and the lessons we learn along the way. So, yeah. Thanks for tuning in. Toodles.